Ole Paulsonen with an unbelievable overtime goal in game two. Bob, how are you feeling? Going into game three in Jacob's barn. Yeah, Peter, I'm curious to see how Ole's gonna do in a brand new barn. He's not very good at adapting to his environment. We're gonna head down to rink level and hear from Jacob Bardown. Yeah, obviously it was a tough road loss, uh, but I mean, you can't be upset with overtime. Fans love that stuff, so coming home to my home bar and literally just uh, built this place from the ground up. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. I've been practicing here a lot lately, so I'm used to it. It's a little bit darker on the floor, so I changed the ice surface a little bit. I think it's gonna play into my vanny. Uh, obviously got mad advertising, lots of spawnies here. Um, so spawnies obviously coming in clutch. Uh, they're myself and uh, me. So it's gonna be a good game. I'm looking forward to the first ever game in this uh, in this barn. And I'm just gonna give the fans what they want. Well, Peter, you heard it here first. Jacob Ardown is excited to get going in his brand new barn and put on an absolute show. Yeah, Bob, he seems pretty fired up. Let's head down to rink level and hear from Ollie. I know coming into game three here, I capitalized big in the Capitalized big in that uh, second game there. Um, I'm a clutch overtime player, everybody knows that. I'm not too familiar with this barn. A lot of banks, there's a back wall bank, a side wall bank, a si other side side wall bank. Home ice advantage is gonna be crucial at this rink. So I'm just looking forward to playing in a new, uh, in a new barn and I'm looking forward for another win here. And, uh, and just for my fans, this is for you guys. Thank you. Well, not a whole lot of useful information from Oli. But that's to be expected. His brain is literally the size of a peanut. You ain't wrong about that, Peter. Ladies and gentlemen, game three, now. Welcome aboard. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Oli posting it. And now, the Virgin Island Elite Coconut Cutters Captain. The leader for most stick infractions in one game. Your captain, your assistant captain, and your starting goalie. Ladies and gentlemen, Jacob Arden! looks absolutely fired up here today in his home barn. The crowd is absolutely electric right now here tonight. Peter, the crowd is electric here tonight. All the red and the flames. Some people compare Jacob Ardown to the devil, and it's not hard to see why. He plays dirty, he plays mean, and it looks like he's ready to go tonight, boys. Everyone at home watching on YouTube, please rise and remove your hats for the singing of our national anthem. Welcome to Azkaban. 
period sees only striking first but Jacob will take over with a triple bank and continue to dominate taking a six to three lead heading into second let's go here from Oli oh, you see that first period there he knows all the banks in his home barn here you know I was struggling that first period to just kind of figure out where the banks were going um you know I struck quick I plan on using the same technique in the second period here and I utilize my banks and hopefully come out with uh, with uh, with the lead here in the second period here, Bob. And uh, just, mer just merry, merry Christmas to all you guys out there. I'm going to get a win for you guys. Thank you. Only still trying to work out the kinks. Let's go hear from Jacob. Yeah, obviously, that was huge first. Uh, I let him think that I didn't know the... Uh, I didn't. I let him think that I didn't know the banks. Give him a few and then I absolutely just obliterated him. Uh, so I'm looking forward to it. Uh, just get my coffee in. Uh, keep me hydrated for the second period here. Obviously, you know, uh, Karja is going to come into play here. And uh, obviously, I'm just going to keep trying to get pucks into the net real deep. And uh, my goalie is playing really well. Again, defense is spot on. I've been just rolling my D my lines. Uh, defense is just, there's no one double shifting out there. Uh, forwards, again, just rolling them. I'm not worried about uh, special units or anything. Power play PK like that. So, I'm just going to let the team vibe together. Uh, play Play hard and... Uh, looking forward to the second period and ultimately the end of the game. 
Well, Peter, it's pretty obvious Jacob does not look too worried. Let's go, period two. You don't even know where it is. It's in my mitt, bud. Tuesday. Okay. Meshi, 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 meshi. Oh, hand pad. No. I'm in my zone. that you're not gonna leave yours. Still holds on to an 8-5 to five lead heading into the third. Let's see who takes it. Alright boys, period three. 
Game three, I'm down eight five. I taped up my tongue. Is that thing coming out? No, it's better not. It's pretty taped up. Or yeah. what? Or you can get a delay game penalty. Okay. Yeah! Woo! Eight six, buddy. Keep your head up when you're was, on the train tracks. That was actually a smart play. Eight six. I would eat. Well, I can just see, if you're gonna see, eat the clock, I'm gonna eat the clock. Well, she was like, move, you bang. That's in. You're safe. Holy I hate shit. that jut out. What is he? What is the whole save? Oh, you save. It's in, buddy. No, it's not. I got it squeezed. One more time. That's a penalty. You win. That's a warning. In what league? This one. Come on, man. We'll put the pegs in better. Here, buddy, I'm not you. That's okay. Can't ah! cover center ice. I'm not at center. Oh, oh what a save! What a save! Okay. I'm just Stop going grabbing it. I'm playing defense. Let's go upstairs. There's a crucial goal. Upon further review, the puck did cross the line. We have a good goal. You hear that, buddy? Yeah, it's 8 7. 8 7. That's just hard work. You ever heard of it? What a save! Oh my goodness! Whoa! What a save! Oh, this goal is unbelievable! Done with your time Yeah, let's go. Call your plays. Well, Bob, that is it. Only Poston and Will strike three times in the third period. 
but Bob, it simply wouldn't be enough. That's right, Peter, it just simply won't be enough. Jacob is too powerful. This late goal seals the deal. Let's go hear from Jacob. Oh, obviously it was huge win, 9-7 in the home barn. Uh, I wouldn't have liked that close of a spread, but you know, it's still a blowout, two goal lead. That's uh, absolute weaponizing by me. I know all he's complaining about, but I mean, go back to any game that we've ever played before and just see how he does it. He's got the on-feet violations going on. He plays basically the whole game on his feet. That's a huge violation. So if he's cheating, I'm trying, you know, famous saying. So obviously we're two of the dirtiest players in the league. Um, so that's just how it's going to be. Classic 80s hockey. I'm just going to keep grinding it out and play it. I'm not worried about the league because... I have so much video of Oli just doing the dumbest, dumbest stuff and just being dirty. So I'll see what they say if they're even concerned about it. And I mean, if I got to send a low blow in and go to the league and pout about it just like him, I'll do what I got to do. So I'm looking forward to game four, obviously. Home game, home uh, banks were clutch and I'm just a weapon, you know. I feel good. I did that for the fans and I'm just looking forward to game four. Well, Bob, Jacob threatening Oli. Let's go hear what he has to say about the game. Battle back. Um, a lot of missed calls there. Jacob's just a dirty <laughs> He's covering the <laughs> puck in the middle of the ice. That's clearly a delay of game. Section 115 of the <laughs> rule book. Um, his goalies were cheating. His forwards were cheating on the face-off too. Um, I got a lot of slash marks. Just a dirty <laughs> Um, you know, my boys, we're just going to forget this game ever happened. We're going to focus on game four. And we're going to try to memorize these bank shots. And, uh, talk to the league about Jacob's play. Because he's a rat. And it's just frustrating to play against someone so so sh So we're, we're just upset we're going to take it to the league. Thank you. Well, Bob, we heard it here first. Both players going to the league again to complain. What a bunch of crybabies, Peter. All right, that is it for us tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for tuning in to the 2022 Mini Stick Championship Cup of the World. Like the video, drop a comment, and we will see you guys game four.